our nations and in our countries, Father God, and in our lives, Father God. We will have salvation in every area of our lives, Father God. Salvation to prosper in our souls and our minds and our lives and families and relationships, Father God, and to prosper with you, Lord. And we won't regret it when we have that godly sorrow, Father God, and repent for the evils that we're doing that re- produces repentance, leading to salvation. So when we, the quicker we will repent, Father God, and have that godly sorrow and repent for the evil stuff that we do, Father God, we will have, we will get your salvation through your son, Jesus Christ, because you are our salvation. Jesus is our salvation. I think, but we will regret it if we don't repent, Father God, for the wicked things that we do. We will get your judgment. Non-repentance brings your wrath and your judgment also, Father God, when we do not repent for the evils that we do as well. I thank you, Lord, that you give repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins. Acts 5.31 Father, I pray for repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins of Israel, Father God. And Lord, I thank you for doing that for the country of Israel according to Acts 5.31 I myself Father God and all Americans and all Canadians in Canada and all nations in this world will arise and go to our Father, go to you our Father which is you Jehovah Yah and you Father God will say to us and we, I'm sorry, I'm sorry about that and we Father God in America, myself, and all Americans and Canadians in Canada and all nations in um, every nation in this world will say to you, Father God, to you, Jehovah Yah, Father, we have sinned against heaven and before you, Father God, Luke fifteen eighteen, we will say that to you, Father God, in America. I myself and all Americans and all witches and warlocks and Satanists and Masons and Freemasons, Father God, and dark occultists and sorcerers and spellcasters and all rebellious Protestants, you know, rebellious people, Father God, prodigals will say that, Father God, that they have sinned against you. And they will repent and turn away from their wicked ways. They will admit that they have sinned against you, Father God. All over America. All over Canada. All over all nations in this world, Father God. And people in these churches that have been sinning against you in America, serving the devil and worshiping the devil and idols and stuff, Father God, and being hypocritical about everything, Father God, they will repent to you too, Father God, and ask for your forgiveness for all the wickedness and lukewarm stuff and hypocritical stuff that they do in these churches, all the evil stuff and mistreating your lambs, mistreating each other and not loving the lambs, not loving each other like your word command us to and the preachers sitting up there teaching false doctrine and stuff, Father God, and mistreating the kids and the people in the church and controlling them and keeping them ignorant, Father God, of your word so they can control and manipulate them and dominate the people in these churches, Father God, mistreating your flocks in these churches in America and Canada and all nations in this world, Father God, that these evil leaders in these churches will repent to you for the evils that they're doing, the wickedness that they're doing to the flocks, your flocks in the churches, because these flocks only belong to you, Father God, that they have been lying to and misleading your the people in the flocks in these churches, Father God, to trip them up so they can't secede and, and fight against the devil and be bewitched and stop, Father God, and fall into Satanism and witchcraft, Father God, and doing all type of worldly sins and lusts. So, Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ, I thank you that your word is done in the lives of all Americans and Canadians and all nations in this world and in my life, Father God, to repentance. Thank you for the revival of repentance for all 
Americans in America, for all Canadians in Canada, for all nations, Father God, all over this world, in Jesus Christ's name, for soften up our hearts to repent and turn away from the devil and rebel against the devil and stop conforming to the devil and to the world and start submitting to you, Father God. And s- submitting to your word and submitting to your kingdom way of doing things and to your leadership and to your rulership, Father God, to your kingdom of righteousness, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name that we will put you first, Father God, that we will first seek your kingdom and your righteousness and all things will be added to us, Father God, in America and Canada and every nation in this world. And then I will also First seek your kingdom and your righteousness, Father God, and all things will be added unto me, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, I pray that for all Americans, for all nations in this world, for all Canadians in Canada, in Jesus Christ's name, and for myself, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. Hallelujah. Father, I thank you that this prayer is done and I ask that you will seal these prayers with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. Father God, thank you for answering these prayers and listening to these prayers because this is a very urgent prayer cry for um, a spirit of revival, of repentance, Father God. A contrite spirit to repent of the wickedness that we do and to stop doing the evils that we're doing and stop serving other gods and worshiping other gods and idols and stop doing so much dirty, crooked stuff, devious stuff to hurt each other. Stop being so mean and nasty and cruel and stop being like jackasses and a-holes all the time to each other, Father God. I just thank you, Father God, and stop all this stupid hatred. Stop hating ourselves and stop hating everybody else and stop hating you, Father God, that we will stop hating ourselves. We will stop hating our fellow man. We will stop hating you, Father God, and start hating the devil and hating the wickedness of evil, Father God. We will hate what you hate, Father God. Help us to hate what you hate. To hate sin the way you hate sin. To hate evil the way you hate evil. And to love the way you love, Father God. All over America, all over Canada, and every nation in this world, Father God. And help me to hate what you hate, Father God. And and to hate sin like you hate sin. And to hate evil like you hate evil. And to love the way you do, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Thank you for the restoration of a contrite spirit to repent in America, in Canada, and all nations in this world. And thank you for... Keeping me contrite in spirit, Father God, to repent when I need to repent, Father God, of sins. In Jesus Christ's name, and I ask that you will cleanse our hearts out, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ from all iniquities in our hearts, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ in my heart, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ, all iniquities and impurities in my heart and in the hearts of all Americans, in the hearts of all American leaders, in the hearts of all Christian American leaders and in the hearts of all Canadians and Canadian leaders and Canadian Christian leaders and in the hearts of all leaders in every nation in this world, Father God. With the blood of Jesus Christ, it will make our hearts white as snow with the blood of Jesus Christ. And that you will flush away all this iniquity and these sins, Father God, out of our hearts, Father God, in America, in Canada, in all nations in this world. And in my heart, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name, that you are making our hearts white as snow with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. Oh, Lord, cleanse the land in America, cleanse our hearts in America by the blood of Jesus Christ, by the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, cleanse my heart from iniquity. 
guarantees by the blood of Jesus Christ by the blood of Jesus Christ my Lord make my heart in the hearts of Americans of Canadians of all the people in this world white as snow by the blood of Jesus Christ cleanse our wicked hearts of Lord by the blood of Jesus Christ the blood of Jesus Christ our Lord Jehovah yeah, Jehovah God Jehovah yeah, Jehovah yeah. Yeah.